when I moved to the Little Sugar Loaf, it was just like I'd come home. Right. And I was doing this shamanic work at the time, you know, and one of my one of my um, one of my job one of my things that I had to do was to light a fire outside and to stay out all night, you know, and I had the stones. It was a transformation and owning my place and naming my place and having my borders all around me, you know. And uh, So hang on now, we're not gonna skip over this bit. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, I, so the, I'm, so, I'm, a, I'm a medicine woman. A medicine woman. Music is my medicine. But so is the earth, you know, the, the land. Now, come on, talk to me. <laughs> so so the sh you're a medicine woman. Yeah. I did my shamanic training with um, Karen and John Schleon Cree. I did more than two years of it. And um, at that time, I was moving from the life, you know, into the life that I am now. I, I'm becoming an older woman, a crone, uh, a hag, getting to like the belly, you know. <laughs> a wise woman, you yeah, know. Yeah. <laughs> but um, there is a confidence that I found that I've never, ever had in my life. Now. Mm. It's a good place to be. And a lightness. And a lightness. Yeah, that's ju that's a uh, very nice to look at. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Do you know, that it's very, you've, yeah, attractive lightness. Yeah, I mean, I have dark days. Yeah. But, you know, I, I know how to overcome them, you know. 